Hello, Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Welcome and welcome, cross watchers. I'm going to be taking a look and seeing what's manifesting for you all, what is going on right now in your current situation with you, the person on your mind, if any, and what you need to know. So, whenever you do see this, it will be the right time. As always, take what resonates and leave out the rest. Practice using your own discernment. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And if you are interested in a personal reading, I'll leave all of that information in the description box below. Follow me on all social media as well. TikTok, Instagram. I am spiritually goldy on all platforms. Oh, Gemini. I feel like you're afraid that something's not going to work out. Afraid of maybe feeling uh, alone or isolated. I feel like you're pushing forward though. It's like there is something about you that just keeps pushing forward and you're you're not giving up regardless of like how scary something may seem or how unknown it is or um, the fears of like being alone or being isolated and in a place that you don't know with people you don't know um, or leaving something behind um, for a, a moment, a temporary moment of maybe being in isolation, doing something for for you, okay? We have two aces here, ace of wands, ace of pentacles. I, there's a, and the world, there's a really amazing opportunity here. This could be a work opportunity. I feel as though something big Something big is coming your way. You have a victory. There is a victory after a struggle. Um, but something is like a realization that something is really happening. It's like I'm hearing getting closer and closer. So you are getting closer and closer to the very thing that you want. But something about that is also scary. It's like, whoa, like this is really, this is really happening but it's also bringing you a sense of peace so you do have peace coming in and there is gain from this you are gaining from this you are getting a sense of independence and there is the the end of like a battle i'm seeing a truth here making peace um taking a break to maintain the happiness to maintain good energy there could be an apology coming in or some of you are at this place where you are prioritizing your peace more and if it means like putting um, something on a break or not being right then it's like you're willing to do that to prioritize peace for yourself here okay mm. So maybe you're afraid something's not going to work out with someone who you really love or care about. Okay, yeah, you're you're afraid of something ending. Like a, afraid that things are changing, a door could be closing here. It's like all of the worst case scenarios, defeat, uh, wasting your time, wasting your effort on something. But there is some sort of clarity or answer coming in that kind of releases fear. There is a breakthrough here. There's like this saying. Uh, I forgot exactly how it goes, but it's um, something about like the best things can happen. Or amazing things come from like overcoming fears. 
There's beautiful things on the opposite side of fear. That's what I'm hearing, literally. There is beautiful things on the opposite side of fear. On the opposite side of this door, there is more. There is more love. There is um, blessings. Even like a sense of self-love. Doing something that you are afraid of or afraid of change. But there is something beautiful that is... I can see coming out of this here. Okay. So think of somebody that is on your mind. Let's take a look at their energy, see what their energy is saying. Could be dealing with a Leo, Aries, or a Sagittarius. I do see this person as wanting to create balance here with you or wanting to balance the situation out. Something about it is like wanting to support you where you maybe can't support yourself. Someone's wanting to support you in some way. This person does look at the situ situation like there's a lot of victory here. finish line yeah you two are both looking at this situation from different completely different perspectives because this person is seeing this as being victorious um and then you're seeing this as like oh i'm this is a, this is going to be a struggle something about this feels like oh my gosh this is going to be a struggle or what if it doesn't work out but this person is pretty optimistic But I definitely feel this person is aware of a risk that you're afraid to take or afraid of failure. This person sees that you're afraid of, of this not working out here. Meanwhile, this person is like, I, I feel like there's a lot of, dis um, of disappointment in the past. But out of this situation, they feel as though there's a lot of victory here. Okay, I feel like there's something that this person also feels like they are ready to walk away from in order to have balance here with you, in order to create some sort of change here with you. There's something that they are accepting. Okay, interesting. Temperance is here as well. Which is some, you and this person may be very different, like opposites in a way. But this is something about, this is telling me something about like coming together to create harmony or making, there's some sort of compromise made on your end or their end as well. Sacrifices to be made on both ends to create harmony, to create. A, a work of art to create beauty, something beautiful here. Healing, peace. This is also uh, about patience. The advice is with this temperance is, is to be, remain, remain patient. I'm hearing love is patient. We definitely are seeing love here. Knight of Cups. Entering Knight of Cups, entering your life. Love. Someone expressing their love for you, someone following their heart. I told you, beautiful things on the opposite side of fear. A pleasurable outcome. The end of a struggle. This person is somebody who could be very financially stable or wealthy as well or is very close to their family oh okay unexpected there is some sort of unexpected um
compromise or sacrifice this person is making because of their emotions or their feelings for you. Tell me about this love offer. The chariot. It could be in regards to travel or moving something forward. This person um, wants to move something forward with you. Love. Love is entering your life. Look at that. The Ten of Cups. This person doesn't see the obstacles here. But you're like, no, but then what if like this happens? Or um, I don't know, like maybe the distance is too much. Or maybe you're not that sure. It's like they're really seeing this as like there is no... There's no, nothing that can like get in the way for them with you. Like I am seeing the this being something very beautiful and long term and uh, emotionally fulfilling for you. But there is like these fears. Some of you, it's like this fear could lead you to missing an opportunity in in love with someone someone pretty amazing yeah this i'm seeing forward movement here definitely temperance peace love love on the other side of this door it's like i i get a sense of like this uh f this guard like you have guards or walls up but this person is ready to break through those walls <laughs> very very persistent yeah this, this person is is very very persistent ready to break through those walls okay what else does Jim and I need to know right now mm, magic something is manifesting here okay there's some of you that's fear of rejection don't allow the fear of rejection or the fear of something not work out hold you back from for an, an opportunity that you you really want don't allow that fear to sabotage you i'm seeing the number eight six nine sixteen the letters p v f l i those letters can be in your name or someone else's name but with that said, this is what I'm seeing. If it did resonate, let me know. If you made it this far in the video, thank you so much for watching. I hope that you all have an amazing and blessed rest of your day. Bye.